Welcome Gemini, this is your Abundance, Money and Prosperity reading. This is the season reading for uh, Sagittarian. So it's a Sagittarian um, Abundance and Money and Prosperity um, season reading. So, 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 um, so what we have here, um, we have the energies of success for you Geminis. Um, this is wonderful, it's um, good. Um, success is coming up for you, Geminis. There's no question about this. Um, success has work. So remember, the Sagittarian season begins from the 22nd of November until the 30, 21st of December. So um, you're coming in the season with a powerful energy of success. Um, I see some of you are going to be receiving some sort of a news of a salary, um, salary, increased salary and that is going to be good i see a lot of you are going to be successfully finish off in a project um something that you are creating working on you have successfully ended the situation you're overcoming a lot of obstacles that was placed uh, um for you and uh, i see that you're working and if you're not working, it could be your home business that you are going to be manifesting a whole lot of money that is going to be coming in to you and you're going to be successfully um, moving forward. So some of you, if you are asking for any financial stability, ask for it in the first week. It is going to be a yes. In the second week, I see a lot of you are balancing out a whole lot of situation at the workplace and this is going to be good. So I see wonderful positive alignment of energy where you are realizing that you need to balance out some sort of an issue um, that was going. And some of you were dealing with clients. You were dealing with people in your department. There was a whole lot of issue and problem. Some of you had some sort of a legal issue with the company that has to do with the company, with clients and outside people. Then we see in the third week, you're balancing out a situation. So it's all about balance. Um, this Sagittarian period is all about balancing, balancing um, ways and means how you can manifest more financial abundance and financial stability in your world. And this looks good for the spirit because at the end of this period, you are going to be um, aware of how you have brought certain um, situation back into balance. It was as if some sort of a situation was out of balance in your world, in your life. And as you move out of um, the Sagittarian season, you're going to be realizing that you have uh, rebalanced all of uh, your financial issues, all of the money issues, um, all of the issues that has to do with a late, um, you know, um, uh, being late on certain payments and all of that, you are going to be learning to balance this out. So what we're seeing is that it's going to be a very successful um, time. I see you're going to be having success with your, um, if you're working in customer service or sale, you're going to be having a lot of huge success, a lot of clients. So um, if you're selling anything, if you are marketing, um, this is going to be good. This is going to be a very good period. A lot of you are going to be creating new ways uh, and means of uh, um, marketing your products. And I see that this is going to be um, really, really satisfying uh, to the public. The public is going to be happy with what they're receiving. So I see a lot of you, your creativity is going to be high in the Sagittarian period. And your opposite sign is the Sagittarian. So this is really good. And uh, as a Gemini, um, this is a good time for you, Geminis, because uh, it's as if your opposite sign of the Sagittarian is really helping you. And Sagittarian is Jupiter, is helping you to rebalance out your materialistic wealth and your financial stability. So when we look at this, this is really good because it's as if in this period you finally catch up with certain things that was going on. Um, the beginning of the year, certain things was like out of balance and now you're getting and rebalancing um, the situation and really finding out how um, you could um, bring that balance to your financial world. So I see prosperity 
um, is going to be happening. And, and, and like some of you could have seen it already coming in, but some of you are going to be seeing it sometimes between now and December 21st um, that you're going to be definitely getting a message of salary increase, definitely getting a message that whatever issues and problems you were going through, you're going to be working them through. Because if you notice twice, justice and the two of pentacles is about balance. So you have the air energy in the second week, which is next week, that is going to be bringing in some real positive, positive uh, um, energy for you. And in the third week, you're having, um, you're going to be balancing out everything because it is as if you're making the right decision um, towards uh, um, creating a better financial stability in your world. And this is going to be good. Then what we are seeing is that you have used, um, you have received some sort of a creative uh, initiative and you're working on it and you're going to be seeing and realizing that it is going to be paying off in big ways so remember life is about recreating your world in order to fit what it is that is transpiring in your um financial world and your uh, and your um your wealth okay it is about balancing uh, creating your own prosperity creating your own um abundancy and what we're seeing here is that you are going to be receiving help help is going to be coming in in order for you to really um create what it is that you're looking for in your own personal life and this is going to be good um as you look at the top, there is four elements. You can choose one of these elements in order to see what these elements uh, and which one, because you need to choose one. I would advise just to choose one because sometimes people choose all four and then you're totally, completely uh, a numb as uh, um, which one um, to choose. So I would say um, whenever you're going to look at... Uh, the extended um, of this reading because it's just showing you what you have to deal with and what you have to accomplish. Then as you choose one of these four, um, you will uh, be able to choose the correct um, uh, direction to go in. It is going to be giving you um, advice as to which direction um, in this uh, Sagittarian season to choose in order to make a decision for you. So I see help. Help is going to be coming in. People are going to be um, supporting you and helping you financially. I see um, balance is going to be coming in where I see people and bosses and that sort of a thing is going to be realizing um, your potential and is going to be trying to help you to rebalance a situation that was created. I see now you're finding out and now you're understanding why um, so many things was out of balance. Now you're really, really figuring this out for yourself and, and, and putting in the time and effort in order to rebalance, uh, in order to bring back a balance to your own financial um, abundancy. So help is going to be coming in. There is no question about it. Whatever issues you were dealing with, whether legal or non-legal, it is going to be balancing out in your favor. Whatever challenges you had on the work floor, it is also going to be balancing in your favor. You are going to be the one who is going to be standing up and bringing back this balance in your world and in your life. And you're going to be realizing how super, super um good you are when you just listen to your own self and listen to your intuition who are you going to be dealing with in this uh, um uh, the Sagittarian period that has to do with your financial stability you're going to be dealing with a Taurus a Libran a Capricorn and uh, um a Scorpion okay now whatever is transpiring and whoever the Scorpion is uh, the Scorpion is uh not vibrating in a positive direction. And you got to be aware how you deal with the scorpion in the last week because the scorpion is a little bit, um, he will sting you at any time. He or she will sting you at any time. And when I say sting you, is that he or she um, will be um, so, so you have to really 
um, know how to deal with this person, okay? So if you do not have to um, connect with this person, I would say leave this person so that they can balance on their in, in their own energy because I see that this person energy is a little bit off um, in this period and this is a major arcana. So understand that this person energy is a little bit off and they're in the reverse. So let it be it's as if they're, um, you know, too much is going on. Their frequency is a little bit off. So be aware and just stay out of uh, um, this person direction so that you um, can just balance out your own energy instead of uh, being in confrontation with this person. Okay. So, um, the the I see um if you are having some sort of an issue, the Taurus and the Liberants are going to be helping you, and the Capricorn. Taurus, Liberants, and Capricorn is going to be helping you out. So open up for the energy because these people will come in and work in alignment in order to balance out whatever issues and situation is going on. So, Gemini, that was it. If you want to see the extended, and I have to do it in extended because then you have to choose one of these energy in order for you to create your own world. Um, you can connect with the channel and join the channel and you can see the extended to these. It is very important. Um, these are coming out every month and you can just join the channel. It's a dollar ninety nine. You see the extended of the monthly readings and also of the season readings because the season readings, the monthly reading comes out every month. But because it's such a long reading, you have to join the channel in order to, um, find out, uh, uh, what direction um, this is going to be moving in. All right. So I love you guys. Um, leave a message. Let me know how it is going for you and what is coming up in this season. Remember, we have four weeks. So um, some sort of a help is coming in the first week, second week. Uh, some sort of an imbalanced situation with your bosses at work is going to be balanced. Third week, you're balancing out everything. You're going to be ready in time for Christmas. Stay away from the scorpions at this time. I gotta go. Namaste.